friendship, they were uh, they started because we all ride dirt bikes. Yeah. Which is a technical sport, which is an adrenaline sport. We had an ID, and with it as ID, we came here to Valkenburg. And uh, yeah, with something special, uh, get some adrenaline in, uh, in our bodies and uh, get a really good team together. Yeah. So it was a no-brainer, let's get together and uh, do this. And we built a very special craft. It's, uh, it's based on the theme of, uh, of the team of 88, the soccer team from Holland that uh, won the European Championships. And we uh, decided to do that to give the current team some inspiration, a uh, boost. And what we did, we had this uh, frame of a go-kart. Uh, we took the engine out, we modified the frame. We uh, figured out in Saltworks what the center of gravity was, put it a little back to make sure that the, the car doesn't dive and gets to the finish line in one piece. Uh, then we uh, measured you know, the, the, the strength of the, uh, of the frame. You know, a gore kart doesn't jump things, and we will. So we measured that, we did a strength analysis. It turned out great. You know, the frame can, uh, can take a beating. And the last thing we did uh, to make the car uh, perfect is decide how will the body look and what's the best body to get the optimal aerodynamic flow. We, uh, we did an analysis and CFD flow in, in, in SolarWorks and we figured out that uh, making it a little round is better than making it flat or making it cone. So uh, after we decided that we built the body, uh, we used this synthetic leather that looks really nice for a cool finish and, and the look of the soccer uh, shoe. And we tested it, and uh, Tron took it out and tested it, and uh, you know it turned out uh, great. Here we are at the, at the start of the of the Red Bull uh, Showbox race. Up there, this is where uh, where we will be uh, at the beginning. Yeah, the obstacles are going to be a challenge because I think there were like four or five obstacles, and it depends on how wet it's going to be. First of all, the start was really good. The team did a really good thing about yeah, the, the timing on the start. A lot of power, so I felt that it was a high speed on the, on the first corner. So after the first corner, we had that, that jump, and the jump was already, then I, ooh, that is gonna be a heavy one. But I had, yeah, the car was really good in, in, in control. And after that other big jump, yeah, the seat was the problem. Unfortunately, we, uh, we had a crash. We did a technical analysis and um, we watched all the, all the video. And it turned out that uh, the plastic seat um, got squished through the, uh, the frame. So uh, due to a really, really high jump, you know, the, the force just got too much and, and pushed the plastic through the, uh, the, the bottom of the frame. And what happened then is that the plastic got, got a hold of the, the road, actually kind of folded up and pushed him out of uh, out of its way and uh, you know uh, and then we had the hill build because we couldn't, couldn't control uh, the car anymore i'm really proud uh, of the team and i'm really happy with yeah with the concept that we have now and with solidworks that we yeah did um, a good combination with everything uh, and next year i think uh, we need to organize a little little details yeah, yeah we got the speed we got the aerodynamics, the frame worked really well because you know it needs to do handle well and it, it did. Yeah, and it's just a small thing that we didn't uh, simulate that uh, was the problem in the end. So we got 95% right and next year we, uh, we take the other five and uh, go for the win.